What's going on, everybody? It's your homeboy, Popular Video Games here. Chilling out, Max, and I'll do my thing on Xenoverse 2. Alright, y'all. Now, in today's video, we're going to be talking about Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. DLC packs 1, 2, and 3 wish list. Let's get into this. Now, we already got leaks that suggest we're going to be getting Universe 6 fighters in an upcoming DLC. Now, that's most likely going to be DLC pack 1. Now, Universe 6 fighters for DLC pack 1 is going to be awesome. But what about 2 and 3? Let's get into this. Now, 2 has to be something with Dragon Ball GT. Literally, there isn't really much reference from GT in Dragon Ball Universe 2. It really isn't. You have Pan as a master, but you really don't have much else. You don't have a fight with the dragon. You don't have any parallel quests with them, which we all truly enjoyed in Xenoverse 1. So I believe that they're going to be bringing that in Pack 2. They cannot really disclude Dragon Ball GT from Xenoverse 2 since it was such a fan favorite in Xenoverse 1. Could you guys imagine if they came out with a story mission and they put Time Breaker on those dragons? Oh dear lord, they're going to be as powerful as Time Breaker Yamcha. Now, for those of you who are Xenoverse players who played when the game first came out, you pretty much have already gotten to Time Breaker Yamcha. He's extremely powerful, and I believe that the dragons will make a credible source as well. Now, they can have it. We come back into a time when Kid Goku, Pan, and Trunks first meet one of the dragons, and then we go from there. And they actually introduce more than freaking three dragons. Introduce more of them. I want to actually play against all of the dragons. And honestly, that's what would make a great DLC back too. For us to be able to fight against all of the Black Star Dragon Ball Dragons. Seriously, like, I mean an actual mission where I'm seeing a cutscene where they're talking and everything in there. It's not just what I'm playing as right now and then you see text at the bottom. I want a real DLC quest mission for them. I know you guys can agree as well. All right. Now we're going to get into Dragon Ball Xenoverse Pack 3. That has to contain something about the Immortal Gods. Now, they already included Black Goku in here. Now, they have to bring in Super Saiyan Pink. Why wouldn't they? Not to mention they have to bring in something with Zamatsu. I mean, Zamatsu's mystery was one of the biggest in Dragon Ball history. They have to bring in Zamatsu. And they also have to bring in Gowatsu as well. Bring in some good old favorites. And hey, merge Zamatsu. Now he's already going to be coming out in the next episode. Now you can expect that in DLC Pack 3. Now, when they did Revival of F DLC, Xenoverse came out before Revival of F. Then, after Revival of F came out, then the DLC pack came out with it. Guys, put in the comment section. I want to hear what you guys have to say about the DLC pack. What do you think about this? I really want to hear what you guys have to say. If you haven't already gotten Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2, I recommend you get it for the Xbox One, PS4, and the PC. Alright, peace out y'all and talk to you. Laters.